Weather Rate certified most accurate forecast in Central Texas. This is Fox 44 Weather with Chief Meteorologist Mike LaPointe. A for a parade, that is for sure. A lot of sunshine today and uh, <laughs> we hit 98 degrees, the record high temperature today, 98 degrees. And guess what? We are looking at those temperatures to be a little bit above average over the weekend, but nothing like this. Our old record was 92 set back in 2003. You know, the air was pretty dry out there today, so it kind of snuck up on you. It didn't feel like 98 degrees, even though it really was. And we're at 77 degrees at this hour here in Waco. It's also 77 down toward Temple, 79 Colleen. Still a bit on the warm side, though. We had some storms just to the southeast of the College Station area. Current temperature there at 81 degrees. Our winds, you can see the arrows kind of going all over the place here, but behind the frontal system, still a bit on the breezy side, about uh, 10 to 15 miles per in a lot of areas. You can see a 26 though popping up here in Waco. You can tell where the front is because look at the arrows. They're still out of the south. So the cold front basically south of the College Station area and eventually we'll see those winds change throughout the uh, Brazos Valley all from the northwest. And there it is. Right now we'll put the showers and storms into motion for you. And again, we had that tornado watch that was in effect uh, up around the Palestine area, Limestone, Freestone County, Navarro County until midnight. But uh, as expected, they did drop it early because most of the storms have pushed away. But these are some whoppers. That is for sure south of the Lufkin area. And you can see College Station. You've got a pretty strong cell to your south and to your east. And that's all tracking to the southeast too at about 40 miles per hour. So you are in the clear now. We are watching that uh, wind change direction behind the front out of the northwest. So no more severe weather, but out ahead of it, it's going to be a rough night for the folks there in south central parts of Louisiana with that front bearing down in that region. But back here, skies are clear. It's quiet. Temperatures are in the 60s by midnight. And then overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning, we're going to drop into the 50s. Just some high clouds from time to time, but still looking pretty good. Mostly sunny skies, some high cirrus clouds drifting through, and those are those high clouds you see way up in the sky there that uh, don't bring any rainfall. So no rain in the forecast, just some clouds, high clouds from time to time. Otherwise, mostly sunny. High temperature should top out around 78 degrees. And then as we hit Saturday night, high pressure in control, that will slide right on top of us. High pressure means very quiet weather. The air will be sinking, so clear skies. Temperatures will be in the 50s to start. And then that high slides down to the southeast of us, and we'll get the back side of the high. Since high pressure rotates like a clock, we'll get those south to south easterly winds moving up our way, and that will allow those temperatures to be a little bit warmer than Saturday. On Sunday, we should make it into the low to mid 80s here across the region. As for tonight, though, mostly clear skies, still a bit on the breezy side, though, about 56 degrees, the low temperature. And then tomorrow, mostly sunny skies, a very comfortable day, and we'll see a few high clouds, but nothing again that'll bring any uh, storms or anything like that. 78 degrees will be the high. And as we look ahead here, again, a mix of sun and clouds on Sunday, 81, 85 for the high on Monday, chance of showers and storms late. On Tuesday, we'll have to watch for some strong storms once again. That's the front. As the front moves through, we go from 90 on Tuesday into the 80s. Wednesday and Thursday, even upper 80s on Friday there with nighttime lows also starting to sneak up. And as you notice, down toward uh, parts of the uh, Bryan and College Station area, you're going to be clearing it out tonight. Then quiet weather over the weekend. Mix of sun and clouds, 80 on Saturday, 83 on Sunday, 86 on Monday. And there's that storm system. It's kind of a, a dry line slash cold front that's going to be moving through. So again, we'll watch it. This is the time of the year for the strong storms. 87 degrees should be out of here by Wednesday. And you can see already by the tail end of next week, we are looking good. Could see another 90 on the board on Friday under mostly sunny skies. But I don't know about you, Adam, but it didn't feel like 98 degrees today. It certainly today. 